Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. This is Lena and I hope that you guys are doing amazing wherever you are. I'm back with another reading. Okay, this reading is gonna be on the topic, the person on your mind. So let's see messages from the person on your mind. Okay, the first card is Knight of Pentacles. Very slow. This person is very slow. And I'm also getting a message, something related to your eyes. I don't know what that means. Eight of Swords at the bottom. This person is very slow. This person right now is kind of in a victim mentality. <clears throat> victim mentality in the sense that you know, this person is, I think, going through a phase in life where they're like, my life just sucks. Nothing goes my way. You know, he, this person is kind of in an energy like that. Um, I think this person is having some kind of existential crisis. They're very confused over something. Um, and for now, I think this person is putting you in the back burner, like, like approaching you or coming and talking to you they are putting that on the back burner is the kind of feeling i'm getting and for now i think this person is kind of having an existential crisis page of pentacles this person does want to come forward and talk to you but it's going to take some time yeah this person is right now troubled they could be going through some kind of financial issue or something might not be going their way in their life and now they are just sitting and remorsing over the fact that you know like they're going through that phase where can can anything just go right in my life like why do i keep hitting dead ends everywhere this person is going through a major tower moment in life. Oh my God. Okay. Knight of... Like talk about the tower moment and the tower card is here. This person might be seeing a lot of synchronicities. Like this person is kind of waking up to something is the kind of feeling I'm getting. Like a feeling of spiritual awakening, waking up to some reality. <laughs> oh God, I keep hearing this song. I'm getting the date 4th of April. I'm also getting this um, feeling like, you know, suddenly one day this person is, is going to be like, I want to talk. You know, like suddenly they're going to wake up one day and they're going to be like, I want to talk. That's it. I can't hold it anymore. You know, so I'm getting this kind of a reaction from this person. This person is going to come at you very impulsively <laughs> i keep hearing the song and the song is on the eyes okay so there's something about your eyes that they miss or i don't know <laughs> like your eyes are very magnetic <laughs> oh my god I'm also getting this feeling that uh, you're going to haunt this person in their dreams. Oh, my God. <laughs> um, I'm getting this feeling that you're going to haunt this person in their dreams. Hmm. 
give me a moment let me get those cards uh the cards that fell down were the sun and the seven of pentacles this person has a dream okay like whenever they think about you they think about you or they pictureize you as their perfect match like with whom they can have a family and i keep getting this feeling that this person is you know the kind of feeling i got as if they rehearse in their head the conversations you guys are gonna have like when i say this to him or when i say this to her oh she's gonna reply like that no 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 i should say it like this I'm getting as if someone is rehearsing a conversation in their head, like they're preparing for it. Like when they come towards you, they want to come perfect. I keep seeing crows in my head. This person, this person is going through a major transformation moment because this person might be seeing a lot of crows in their reality, ravens. This person is going through a major awakening. Like they're awakening to the fact that something is wrong here. Like something is not just adding up to it. And they, the moment they wake up to that, they're going to be willing to correct that. Yeah, see, Ten of Swords. I was talking about crows, right? <laughs> the devil. This person is going to, uh, oh, okay. I'm getting this message. This person has the habit of running away from their emotions. Like, you know, those people, the moment they start feeling that, wow, I'm getting attached, they're going to run away from you. So maybe this person has a tendency like that. Like the moment they feel they're getting attached to someone, they run. They just run like a, <clears throat> I'm getting this kind of a feeling from this person, like, they hate they hate to understand the fact that their emotions control them and they freak out like people you know who freak out with their emotions when they start understanding or realizing that wow now my emotions are controlling me this person is kind of having a hold on me and they run from there so this person could be like that I'm getting something about dreams either either you are lately seeing this person a lot in your dreams or this person is seeing you in their dreams <laughs> the situation is gonna turn i'm getting with this wheel of fortune there's going to be an offer presented on the table with the ace of wands getting hot in here I keep seeing the image of a rat in my vision and the rat is running from here to there here to there you know <laughs> wow this person is very restless This person is very restless right now in their life. <clears throat> Something could be significant about June or September. Oh my God. Give me a break, man. Five of Wands. This person is fighting the urge to approach you. I'll tell you why. Why? Because look, Queen of Swords at the bottom. This person is scared. You're not going to listen to them. You're not even going to pay attention to them. This person is scared about the way you're going to react. This person might be very much, they're keeping themselves very distracted so that they don't think about you. For some reason, I got the image of Kim Kardashian. I don't know why I'm seeing her. I'm not her fan as well, so I don't know why I got her image. 
Hangman. Two of swords at the bottom, crows. I'm talking about the crow energy. This keeps coming up. And but wow. Just because they don't want to show how what's going on beneath the surface, they're trying to act like this cold. But this is a show they are putting on. This person is putting on a show of being cold, appearing like, oh, they don't react. But actually beneath that, they are, no, they are messed up. It will take them some time to admit what's happening. This person is running away from their own emotions. They're running away from their own feelings. But how far? <laughs> King of Wands. I cut the deck and I saw lovers. Suddenly it's getting hot <clears throat> here. <laughs> I keep getting this energy. This person is so confused. Like, <laughs> and this person is very scared of you look queen of pentacles queen of swords again came out this person sees you as very chill and calm and doing your thing busy with your own thing and they are like is she even like again this is an energy so it depends um this is the feminine energy so whatever you resonate with <laughs> nine of pentacles okay um for you i'm getting that there's something related to money did you hear that that was a confirmation um i'm getting something some good news related to money for you guys um there's definitely a good news heading your way when it comes to your money i see that for you Ten of Wands. Wow, what is that? What is it? For some of you, I feel you're manifesting a move. This could be movement in career, uh, changing job, literally changing locations. Depends. Okay, I think I'll keep the reading till here. Um, wow. <laughs> this person is soon going to approach you with an offer wow so i'm gonna keep this reading till here i hope you guys resonated and uh, i'm gonna see you again with another reading bye, -bye.